Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Most awkward deck to shuffle ever. I just want to be quiet, guys, okay? Alien, Eight of Wands, Princess of Cups, King of Swords, So sorry guys. I'm not good with Apple. <sighs> okay. So let me just sit with this a minute. What the heck? If I can get rid of this stinking ad. I need to learn how to mute that. Someone doesn't know how to start this journey. Someone doesn't know how to... <sighs> Someone feels trapped here. This is a message, whether it's divine or you sending one, you getting one. Looks like it's going to the Princess of Cups. I don't know if when she answers the phone or answers this message, if she's going to take on the energy of the King of... No, she's not. Okay. So I don't know if it's the King of Swords reaching out to her. I 
going to clarify each one real quick. So it was the Hermit Reverse, so this is somebody coming out of that, that shelter. This Eight of Wands is the, is the Eight of um, Wands, is, is the Queen of Pents. This Princess of Cups is, is the Empress and the Queen of Cups, okay? But, I really, that's how I saw it. That's really weird. about the king of swords so this this hermit this person who you have not been talking to or this is you not talking to the queen of pence okay um but it, it is super spiritual too so this king of swords is thinking about walking back to something Walking away from something and walking back to something. Somebody walking towards the stability. So maybe it's not somebody per se, it's just them walking towards stability. So, I don't know why that just went way up. So, this person that you weren't talking to, or this is you not talking to somebody, is the King of Cups carrying guilt about not messaging. Just carrying guilt when it comes to the Queen of Pence. Okay, um, this princess of cups is to me because she's coming up as a princess. What this is telling me is that she's really she knows how to nurture situations, that is for sure. Okay, but she's very emotional right now. I don't know if she's very emotional when it comes to this king of cups. Is this feminine energy all one energy? Okay. Um, oh crap. So, is okay. So, this feminine energy is all one energy. Okay. So, is she? emotional about the king of swords they're not going to answer me so is this king of swords a different energy okay so is this king of swords going towards this feminine energy They're not telling me. And it would tell me to use my inner knowing, okay, if it wanted me to figure it out. So it's, they don't want you to know. It's, it's like one of those, just leave it in their hands, you know. Um, so... I give it a Bob Molly. I love Bob Molly, but they shut me down. Um, so whomever you weren't talking to, whomever this masculine energy is, is now feeling guilt when it comes to the Queen of Pence. 
Okay, that's that's guilt. That's most definitely guilt. Is this King of Cups having guilt when it comes to the Queen of Pents? Yeah, so that is most definitely guilt. Okay. I um I don't know what it is but me using my pendulum a lot. I'm just drawn to it. I, normally I just use it personally, me or my readings, that type of thing, but it's it's calling for me in readings. I don't know why. Okay. But so this king someone that was in hermit mode in a cave feeling trapped something, okay? Feels so much guilt when it comes to this Queen of Pens now. This this the Eight of Wands is a message. To me, it's it's ironic because to me it's always always a spiritual journey, but like I gotta be realistic and live in the 3D. So it's like to me, is this Eight of Wands speaking about reaching out via text, phone, email, that communication. Okay. So that's communication coming into the Queen. The Empress. Okay, so he looks at her like the Empress. But she's really emotional right now. Really extremely emotional. Um, but she's good. She's she's definitely good. Um, and then it involves this king. Okay, so we got the water in the air again. It, it only makes sense. Earth too, obviously. But like, this king... is thinking about walking back. I mean, it's a message. So, like, I just don't understand. Tell me about this Eight of Cups. Hi. Who is that? Hi, Lonnie. Um, tell me about this Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups. Tell me about this Eight of Cups. I, I think I'm just looking for one. If it doesn't give it to me, it doesn't want me to have it, okay? So, hi. Hi, we're how, going. How was your day? You're going? Yes. All right. Good. Good. Um, in my jacket pocket. I didn't bring mine up, but we're going to do that. It's okay. okay. In my jacket pocket, the top left hand... What breakfast nook are you going to? What? What breakfast nook are you going to? I don't know. Well. Every place, every breakfast place is called a diner. A diner? Breakfast nook is in your house. Okay. Anyways, um, where's that girl? I might want something. Okay. I'll text you. Over. Love you too. Case upstairs? Huh? Casey up here? No, please. No, she's in the car. Tell her I said hi. Hello. I love you too. She got finals all week. So this King of Cups feels like, this King of Swords feels like he missed an opportunity somewhere. Okay. Is this a missed opportunity? So it's saying it's not a missed opportunity, but this person feels like they missed an opportunity. Okay, so it looks like a crap show, if you ask me. It looks like lack of communication. Okay. Looks like lack of communication. There's been silence. There's now guilt about lack of communication. Okay. Um, it looks like they they feel like they missed an opportunity, but they most definitely didn't, is what it's telling me and, and telling you. Okay. But this person feels like they missed an opportunity with the Empress, which is it's just this, this earth, every queen. You know, Empress absorbs every queen. Okay. Um, so, it looks like a crap show of emotions, if you ask me. I, I, if you ask me, my best advice would talk about it. Okay. Um, if you can't talk about it, then obviously you're waiting on this person, and I hope you're waiting the right way. But... This is, this, is, 
just tell me what's next. What's next? Okay, that's the wheel. So next is, is Destiny with the tower right underneath it. Okay. Um, you can't avoid it. It's unavoidable. What's next? Oh, the wheel. Okay. So, it wanted to... I, I thought about keeping it out. <laughs> um, it's the wheel. It's, it's destiny. Okay. Um, I think it's just coming or it's, it's together. I mean, it's, it's a strong message. It basically telling you that this masculine energy as of right now feels a lot of guilt for, I think the silence, not communicating. Okay. Um, and the feminine energy is really upset. And I think what part of the holdup is, is that this king feels like they missed an opportunity. But destiny is here, okay? So that's, that's divine intervention to me right now all day, okay? Um divine intervention the wheel yeah so this this empress is upset so it's it's not telling us well back to that again okay so we kind of I forgot it wasn't telling us but it's it's telling us you know with the queen of cups reversed that's somebody who's upset that's the way I saw it come out that's the way I put it that's the way they wanted me to leave it okay this one, this masculine energy feels like they missed an opportunity. So to me, it looks like a hold up. All right. Um, So there's confidence here, but there's there's some type of worry. So the, I mean, they both look a little worried. Maybe they're just both worried about talking. I'm not quite sure. Whatever your whatever you can gather from this is yours, you know. Um, but that that communication, that's that's lack of communication. To me, it's it's coming in. Okay. Um, tell me about this Eight of Wands. It's coming in from the Emperor. Okay. So, or someone's gonna take the lead, which would tell me it would be the masculine energy. So. It looks like there's lots to talk about. Okay. I love you guys. Bye.